Hey everyone, welcome to Iwasaki's Plays and Replace. This is Doom. Today, we're diving into the adrenaline pumping world of Doom, a reboot of the iconic first person shooter series that redefined fast paced action for a new generation. Whether you're a longtime fan of the franchise or a newcomer to the series, Doom delivers an experience that's hard to forget. Let's rip and tear through what makes this game stand out. Doom is set on Mars, where a research facility run by the Union Aerospace Corporation has accidentally opened a portal to hell. You play as the Doom Slayer, an ancient warrior awakened to stop the demonic invasion. The story is minimalistic, staying true to the original's roots, and serves more as a backdrop for the relentless action. While not deep in narrative, the setting is immersive, filled with detailed environments that range from the blood-sucked halls of the UAC facility to the hellish landscapes you tear through. The gameplay in Doom is where the game truly shines. It's all about speed, aggression and fluidity. The game encourages you to keep moving, rewarding you for playing offensively with health and ammo drops from defeated enemies. The arsenal is vast and satisfying, from the classic shotgun to the devastating BFG 9000. The glory kill system adds a brutal and stylish way to finish off weakened foes, keeping the combat fast paced and visceral. The movement mechanics are smooth, and each encounter feels like a well-orchestrated dance of destruction. Doom offers a campaign that can take roughly 10 to 15 hours to complete, depending on your playstyle and difficulty setting, which may provide a satisfying experience. It's a game designed for replayability, with multiple difficulty levels, secrets to uncover, and a combat system that is quite engaging. Doom is a masterclass in how to revive a classic franchise. It's fast, brutal, and incredibly delightful. Whether you're here for the non-stop action or the thrill of hunting down every last secret, this is a must-play for any FPS fan. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this pre-game review, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more content like this. As soon as I beat the game, a post-game review will be uploaded as well. Until next time, and see you around!